I really like skeletons. I know, I know, I've talked about this before. I really like skeletons. I'm glad this game has cool skeletons. And I know I was promised cool, cool skeletons before I played the game. That's actually one of the reasons I played the game. Um, but still, it's I really like Papyrus. He's he's great. Sans is good as well, of course. But like, oh my god, this guy is superb. <sighs> okay, here we go. Mm. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh well. Well, yes, this is a really cool regular attack. Oh yeah, this this one was actually kind of tricky. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, here we go. What the fuck? No! Oh shit. I had to be hit by that, huh? Oh, really? I'm worried what's gonna happen. I'm not trusting that to be the last one. Well, uh, it's clear you can't defeat me. So wait. When I died the first time, it was by one slow, tiny bone left. Because I had too little health to avoid the attack you have to take damage from. Bullshit. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore I, the great Papyrus, I'd like to grant you Pity, I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard and... My friend Quantify will remain stagnant. Really? Y you want to be friends with me? Well then, I, I guess. I, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie, well, we haven't even had our first date. And I've already managed to hit your friends. <laughs> I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, uh, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Uh, anything that can anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except some with a powerful soul. Like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us must can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is? Well, he's a big fussy pushover. Everyone loves that guy. I'm certain if you say, Excuse me, Master Dreamer. Can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have a date. <laughs> I fucking love this game. So yeah, um... Oh, there's... Hello. So you came back to have a date with me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I'd like to spend a lot of time. Oh, okay, we're going on a date now. Cool. Uh... Okay. Where are we going? My house! 
house. Brilliant. Oh, this music is nice. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I take responsibility. Rock is covered in sprinkles. Cool. Oh, kitchen. Okay. Well, let's. Um, how about we um? No, let's let's do the date this episode because we had a fight two episodes in a row. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans. Please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. Oh, what's this? It's a joke book. Take a look inside. No. Uh, welcome to scenic my house. Enjoy and take your time. Ooh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. I can understand that. The door is locked. Okay. That's my room. If you've finished looking around, we could go on in and uh, do whatever people do when they date. Go inside? No. I want to check out the kitchen. Impressed. I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look, see. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. What? Catch that middling canine! Curses! <laughs> oh my god. Sans! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! <sighs> this is amazing. I... My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a, a quiche, but filled with a sugary non egg substance. How absurd. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please! Peru is my culinary art show. Half of is filled with containers, all labeled spaghetti. Good. All the half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Oh, it sounds like my kind of place. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it anytime. Will do. Uh, catch. You touch the couch, it makes a yangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20 G. Oh, we have stole money from our date. Cool. That's my room. Yeah, we know. Oh, making Papyrus' voice really fucking hurts my throat. Ooh. Oh my god, a car bed! I had a car bed when I was a kid. That's so cool. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. It was actually today. Even though it basically just happened. Oh. The internet. I'm quite popular there. Oh god. I... What if he hadn't taken off? Because I know Papyrus is very popular online. And I know Undertale's popular online. What if this game hadn't taken off? This would have been the best thing. I'm just a dust in the way. From a double digit follower account. Oh. So it was actually a Twitter joke. Of course, fame has a steep... Wait, a dozen away? So you're... Minus two. A jealous troll has besigned my online persona. Always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. Oh, I wonder who it could be. That book's one of my favorite. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Ooh, figures. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from... A chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. <laughs> nice. 
Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. <laughs> Wind in my hair, sun on my skin, of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. I was snooze cruising, I guess. That's a Sonic Adventure reference. I mean, let's play of that, you can, you, can, you can watch that. There are no skeletons inside my closet. Well, I mean, that makes sense, I guess. You're on a date with a girl, so yeah. Except me sometimes. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. So, let's buy a pan. That's cool. Look in the closet. Actually, I guess the kid is meant to be whatever. I guess the kid is gender is ambiguous. But since I'm playing as a girl, that's. Uh, look in the closet. Yes, clothes are hung up neatly inside. Cool. So, um, uh, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the? Date? Yes. Okay, dating start. Dating start. Oh my fucking god. Whew. Here we are, on our date. I've actually never done this before. Oh, but don't worry. You can't spell prepare without several letters from my name. That's true. Oh my god. It's not an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. Oh, nice. Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two. Ask them on a date. Ahem. <laughs> Human, I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. <laughs> really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on a nice clothes, so I care. Hmm. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? Uh, yes. No. You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. Oh, shit. N no, your dating power. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet. I, the Great Papyrus. I have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case somebody happens to ask me out on a date. Behold! Holy shit. Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? Love it. No! A genuine compliment! However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This state won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Okay. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip. All clothing artists can be improved this way. That's true. My hat. My hat. My hat! Yeah. <laughs> well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present is just for you. <gasps> you know what this is? Of course. Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But also wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. 
silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Take a small bite. Your face reflects me scrolling up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. <sighs> no. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy, too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you, I, Papyrus, I, um, boy, is it hot in here, or is it just me? Uh, oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me that I was supposed to go on a date with you, then on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison, a passion, with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? <sighs> no, wait. That's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. Uh, but I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, uh, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. But uh, platonically. Well, gotta go. <laughs> See if Sans is home before we leave. That was amazing. Like that was just incredible. Yes, wow. Wow. Holy shit, this game is special. <laughs> I love it. It's so good. Um Like it starts off great and it just somehow gets so much better. It's weird. See you next episode.